1400 meters. All set. And away they go from the 1400 meter marker. Quake shakes a little bit strong, head up in the air, escape clubs right there, stockades on the outside of runners. Under the stars, gorgeous guest is going around them. So is fashion display. They are followed further back by Just Rap, and then comes Flight Club, who's racing about six lengths off the leader at this stage. Then Seek the Summit between runners. Flight Club is along the inside. Then comes Dark Chocolate. They are tracing about eight lengths off the leader. Pink Cadillac and Zanzara. They are the last two, about nine or ten lengths off the leader. Gorgeous Guest is the leader as they move to the 600 meter region. Quake Shake is second at the rail. Escape Club in the box seat, perfectly placed. Stockade on the outside, and then comes Just Rab. They are followed further back by Under the Stars. Then towards the inside is Flight Club, followed by Dark Chocolate, and then comes in Zara. Top of the lane, 400 to go. Gorgeous Guest, the leader. Escape Club goes in for a run. Behind that one, Flight Club, Quake Shake towards the outside, then Just Rab. Seek the Summits trying to get into the race. Dark Chocolate's running on. Zinzara's also making a run now. Escape Club, the leader. Zinzara's running on strongly on the outside escape club just the leader but Zanzara's coming to get them Zanzara won it escape club second seek the summer third gorgeous guest four escape club is the leader but Zanzara comes with a late swoop once again Made up good 10, 11 lengths, and Zanzara comes good to win it, and win it by about a half length or so. Number four at 8.20, Zanzara. Second, number five, Escape Club. Third will go to number two, Seek the Summit. Gorgeous Guest will run into fourth. Dark Chocolate will run fifth, then Quake Shake. Further back is Pink Cadillac, Just Wrap. And then further is Flight Club, Stockade, and Under the Stars. Toad favourite was number five, and that was Escape Club. And Escape Club had a good lead. The winner is three off the right-hand side, Zanzara. The Hussan comes good and puts in a strong claim. And Escape Club on the left-hand side, and Zanzara was eating into that lead with each and every stride. Number four, Zanzara, is now going to record its fifth win. Once again, top right from Warren Kennedy. Back to the studio. Another very impressive performance from Zanzara. She's come from the clouds again to snare them short of the post. Roy War is going to join us in the winner's box here. He's going to give us a rundown of Zanzara, how she's been doing recently. And Roy going to step across here. Roy, if you want to step into the winner's area here and tell us a bit more about Zanzara. It's the way she goes down. You just close your eyes. It's the way that she comes back. Yeah, look, I think I said it before. If this filly had legs, we top top filly. Heart of a line. Once again, Warren Kennedy, he's given her a peach of a rod. Yeah, he knows her well. But uh, I have to hand it to this filly. She's just got a big, big heart. Really respect her. Well, well done for the win. I know Paul and them are away. They would have heard the result. They would have probably watched the race. Yeah, I'm chuffed for Paul. It's his horse. <laughs> 51 grand in the kitty. Split your way. I yeah, know. Great, great stuff. But she's a lovely filly. I wish she had legs. Oof. What a pity. Super. Thank you. Warren Kennedy, he's now ridden her a couple of times and you just seem to gel well with her. Yeah, I think I'm unbeaten on the shell at 3 from 3. Yeah, so very, very uh, big thank you to Mr. Lefson, to Roy and to the team at home. You know, after the last win, they, said, they saw this race and said, let's go for this race, so you're available and made myself available. And, you know, she's a lovely filly. She, she's very upright and it's all well documented about how she goes down and all that sort of thing. But you've just got to trust her, Sheldon, and, and wait for her to come to you. And when she comes to you, she really kicks into gear. It's amazing when she kicks. I saw you come towards the outside and then she floats past them. Yeah, you know, she, she was always building up underneath me and, you know, I was quite a way back. But like I say, you've got to trust her. And when she starts feeling good, she starts lengthening your stride. And she's a filly you don't really want to switch. So I was, I was trying to time her to get a clear run that I didn't have to ease on her or, or find any trouble so that she had a nice smooth run through. And fortunately enough, she got a smooth run through and she won as authority. Well, three from three. Maybe next time we'll see you four from four. Yes, absolutely, Sheldon. Thanks very much. 
Warren Kennedy, another peach of a ride on number four, Zinzora.